Hello, this is Yellow Hobo, and we're playing our adventure guild. You know me. I love guild games, and I love adventure. And they're all mashed together in this game. It's a very story-driven uh, game. You know I do not do that, so I'm just giving you a little heads up. We're going to play on normal. Uh, I'm probably not going to do no Iron Man, just because I like to save and try things out in certain games, especially whenever I haven't made any uh leaps and bounds on it i only got like maybe an hour and a half on this game and i just fell in love with it like this art style is beautiful i do like uh tactical games if they're fun and challenging this one is one of those games so we're gonna skip through a lot of this uh yeah we're just gonna what's what's my name yellow hobo baby all day and get that done yeah, I'm going to hit escape. We're going to get out of this. We're not doing any of the story-driven stuff. If you want stories, that'll be something for you. Now, cool thing about this, right? We're just going to escape all of this. All right, so battle, right? You have all these little buttons and stuff, and you're probably going to have to do what I did and actually go through and figure out what's what. So this is a rogue scoundrel. Uh... M is how you move, so this is high ground. Increase accuracy. So you want to throw this person on there. This bush is actually what we're going to head to with the Lord's this work. scoundrel. Right? And we're going to hit F. And we hit M to move. We hit F to end our turn. I'm going to go ahead and hit That's M again. Map, right? Get on top of this. All I, can see I can probably hit him right with the five. Yes, there. I can. There's five with your lightning go. hits a little bit further than the other skills and we're gonna go ahead and move up a, to about uh, right here thing. um i'll throw a block on and that blocks pretty much everything up to two attacks i think is what that means you know two turns plus 50 block and we're just gonna go ahead and skip the turn here of course you're gonna hit him or hit her that bandit grunt's moving up. Uh, do I have a... Uh, so we got click slash throw knife. All right, so I want to move right here. And is this a, this an artery strike? Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Didn't move into range. So you can right click and remove that. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go up here. And what is it? 72% to hit him. Let's go ahead and do that. Blocked it course he did and in the turn with that and what I'm gonna do here is uh, you see this this rock this earth spike actually makes it where you can rotate it so I'll just hit R a couple times see you can rotate it and there's collision so I'm gonna collide this dude into that and they took an extra two damage beautiful and which procs another um, can I move yes I can just in case we don't get a uh, get this kill for whatever reason uh, we're gonna do this and I might try to just stun to be honest with you Which worked beautifully so I can heal that person. Okay. We'll just hang out here block We ain't even need the block you're stunned. You can't do nothing I'm gonna hit Q and Heal myself with that berry bush beautiful, right? And now we can go ahead Well, I gotta move Got to move it. Get back on the hill. Oh, I can't do that. So, okay. Hit five. Do another save of damage. And this scales a lot. This game's got so much to offer. So much to offer. Does it matter if I hit them from the back? Let's see. Can I hit you from here? No. Let's uh, go ahead and back it up, Girl Scout. And uh, try to do an artery strike. All right. 10% crit. 85% bleed. Beautiful. Victory! And we get some XP, of course. A little bit of XP. Don't let those numbers scare you off from this game, though. Um, it's You get XP from questing, mainly. Beautiful. Now, for these obstacles, you can use the shovel or remove by hand. We are our highest person six, so we're going to have to use a shovel. <laughs> Because it's going to take us uh, away from this. Wait. This place has resources everywhere. Grab it. And looky there. Got some resources. 
And if you ever like, for instance, if you have the same situation, but there's a trap, you can hit R to cycle through if you want to get the trap out of the way. Let's go ahead and go over here. Beautiful. Oh, I didn't see that log until after I picked that one thing, so. And these resources are very useful, and I'll tell you why. Uh, you can uh, craft in this game as well. So once you get to your guild, right, and you're taking over your buddy's guild, one second while I take care of these uh, hogs and uh, whatnot. Okay, so it's trying to tell me to use the system B system, which uses this BP right here. So I'll go ahead and hit B, and this gives you a increased accuracy for the next skill by 30. This can stack multiple times. The hit chance can reach 100%, overriding any effects that might otherwise limit the maximum hit chance. So, pretty useful, right? How far can you move, actually? Um, pretty dang far. So, we're gonna need to uh, probably get up here. Can I hit you with a regular skill? Son of a gun, I can't. So you might have to lightening it up. 100% chance to hit. Did a good amount of damage. That was a heroic hit, right? Heroic hit. Now it's end. Oh, you got charge, huh? Hey, I'm about to run you to a berry bush again. Uh, can I get you here? No. What about, let's do B. Can I move twice with this or no? Well then, I guess we'll just do this. Sneak attack! He's probably coming down and hitting me here. <clears throat> and the battle order is in the bottom left. If you're wondering. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, let's go ahead and... I want to move right here. Go ahead and knock this one out if I can. No, I can't. Okay. What's your B do? No point in hitting it now. Okay... Hopefully it's, hopefully I can get this mage away. Let's go ahead and go right here. Oh crud. Well, sneak attack. So I'm gonna get this uh, person right here. We can take one out, but let's see. Oh, she can't even move there, huh? That's unfortunate. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take one of these out. Which one can I take out? 83%. What if I move away and then try to hit it? Well. I moved too far. <laughs> Watch this. Move behind him. And you have you see these chains right here? You can chain attack and it works out pretty good. Five. And we're gonna need more damage on you. Mm, you should kill that one. So why don't we just move straight down? That should be in range. Give me a two. That should kill. Beautiful. And I'm gonna pop this. I can't use that. Well, why would you even let me open it up if I couldn't use it? <laughs> Silly. Alright, 62%. Success! And a little bit more XP. Looky there. Take it all. And you can see there's a bunch of bandits up here. And I've already healed up my... Uh, I kind of need to give somebody... Oh, well, it's probably my... I, yeah, I need to get my... Uh, the uh, the mana pot. So I guess we'll go ahead and... We can, uh, we can get several ways around this. We can fight them. Or we can uh, not fight them, <laughs> which I'm going to try to do. Uh, I have one of them try to lure their bandits away. Pretend to be bandits. Let's see if you can do it, Maya. You got some BP. Yeah, and party received 50 XP for just tricking those bandits into letting us through. Lock pick. We're gonna use a key, even though we have like a level seven, but that's that's not here nor there. See, we only got 20%. I don't know if we can get more on this initial quest or not, because it's a bonus XP. But I guess we would have gotten it if we would have fought them, right? It's going to make me camp, because I walked around one too many times. Uh, let's go ahead. Uh, we can do... We'll do. We'll use two supplies. And I'll show you a little bit of something-something on there. So, let's get... 
Well, we don't really need first aid. We don't need to keep from getting ambushed. Or, oh, that's pretty good, actually. How about you, bud? We'll just talk to somebody. Here, Maya, you can have some more BP. And Brad, you can have some more BP. Now we're just going to rest. And they have, like, a little talking session with each other. And now we've made it to the similar fortress. Location modifiers. Unable to flee. That makes sense. And this is our sweet, sweet loot. Got uh, four supplies, 400 XP, which will give us some levels. And uh, as you'll see, well, where's the other 200 and something of it? <laughs> so this is going to be the screen you're going to see the majority of. Um, it wants us to go to the tavern and have at least four people or, and have at least four adventures. Okay, so we got three right now, but one severely hurt Maya. And uh, we do have the healer, but I do not recommend using this unless you absolutely need this person because it pisses them off. So you don't want that to happen. See, the thing is, I don't understand why you have a dex strength plus 30 growth and you're a healer. <laughs> you know, I wish there was a way to like we could change it. Every time this character receives or causes fire damage, they lose BP minus 20 fire resistance. Okay, so, I mean, you're good, but you're not good. You got high willpower, which is actually good for a priest. More likely I have positive. Yeah, they got so many things. I'm going to have to go through this and see. Like, this is not going to work because you need intellect and um, willpower. So... We'll get into it here in a second. Oh, and I misspoke earlier. You need uh, wisdom, not not willpower. So, willpower is great for your like bravery points, but if you have read this and uh, where is wisdom, and not very, you're not getting too much on your wisdom either. There's no point in having that person. So, I'm going to get Maxwell. Just because I'm going off stats right now. These aren't like the end all be all type of people. You see, we have a venture limit of 25. And I'm going to get one of these two. I just don't know which one. We'll always act first in the first round of combat, unless ambushed. Endurance, physical resistance, intelligence. See, I just wish I could re roll these things, man. And I'm going to get Odin. He has a blade. Thing. I know he's got a bow right now, but I think I can switch him over to a dagger to be a, like a scoundrel again. Um, don't really like the wisdom buff on him, but he's got strength and uh, dexterity, so not too horrible. Get that. And I need like another... I need a tank and I need... What are you? You're a warrior. I haven't rocked a warrior yet. I'm not going to rock this warrior because that clumsy. And I'm not going to rock a frail warrior neither. So I guess I'm not rocking a warrior just yet. So now it wants us to buy two bandages, two antidotes, two healing pots, and two mana potions. And this gets recycled every, uh, every uh, week it gets recycled. So don't be afraid to buy. <laughs> don't be afraid to buy. Antidotes are pretty good. Mine resistance, me. I do want to get... A few shovels. Because we're going to need them. <laughs> we're going to need them. Because we don't have anybody strong yet. So now we have our first quest available. And this is where you can heal your ventures. But like I said, wouldn't recommend. I'm just going to let, let this person heal. <laughs> Heavily injured for 10 days. We're just going to let them be. So now I got... How many people got to take into these? Location modifier. The level of enemies is lower than usual at this place. Huh. Okay. But how much XP? We, we still get 1900 XP. And 80 common herbs. That's not bad. Don't need a shovel just yet. 75%. Yeah, you know, we're going to do this. But first I'm going to look at uh, if I need to get somebody else. Because having a mage is pretty game changing. It just depends. I, we don't really have a worthwhile mage right now. You know what? I'm just going to go with what I got. And we're going to go do this. Since it's got so many herbs coming in. Also, a little pro tip. You got to put these on your people. So, don't forget to bring them. <laughs> and it's five dodge. Might give that on to 
Darcia. We still got bread too. Cool. Yeah, we'll do Darcia here and give you some dodge. You're not going. Maxwell's definitely coming. Guess we'll just run double rogue <laughs> damage. Can I switch? Ooh, I can. Ooh, look at there. Now, does it matter too much on this? Oh, it didn't let me do it, did it? It's it switched it back. You son of a gun. I wish I could have. <laughs> and uh we gotta bring supplies. It recommends eight. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this. And we got two rogues. You this one should have the ability to go out at night and hunt and get you more supplies. So I'll just bring the eight. Yeah, front rogues. Alright, so gives you this in a big screen. Got some water skins. That'll work. Now, let's hope there's not too many traps. So Darcy is my best one of disarming traps. We're gonna try it. Son of a gun. Uh, we're gonna re-roll a BP. All right, cool. Let's try not to catch too many of these traps. All right, so you want the high ground with your archers. I know you probably already knew that because you're smart individuals, but I gotta say it. Go ahead and skip that turn. We're gonna move you up to right here. We have any bushes that we can hang out in besides that one? No? Okay. And I don't think Mr. Priest here can reach anything with his. Yeah, he's got a got like a little shotgun. Shotgun staff. I'm gonna move you into this bush. Let you just get your cloak on. And we're gonna hang out. No, don't poison me. Thank you. Uh, he can move in the same spot as her? Huh? Okay. Let's go ahead and skip, and then we're gonna run it down on him. 95%, 80%, I'd rather hit hard, so let's go ahead and get this going. Ow. Luckily, we do have a priest, so we can heal. Uh, we can heal poison. Three damage. Look at there, baby. Mm, let's go ahead and go up here and slash this guy. He's bleeding. Beautiful. And who do I want to go for? Let's go ahead and get you. See if I can throw a block. No, I don't have enough AP. I feel like this dude's missing some AP or something. Keep on resisting. We can take you out. We can take you out. Um, who's attacking? Your second. I can hit you, possibly, but I really don't want to. Let's go ahead, take you out since you're gonna get an attack off. Hey, quit that. I just wanna know how they automatically have freaking poison on them. All right, cleave me. Oh, he's poison, no. Sneak attack. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go ahead and take you out. And do I wanna? Hmm. No. No, might as well not. Might as well just hold on to it and see what we can do. Fifty-five percent chance. I don't like that. Uh, can we do this? It's 11. And we're going to go ahead and remove this poison. Can I move right here? 
see if I can hit him from here. 49% chance. Got it. Beautiful. Get a good amount of XP there. Getting some more stones. Doesn't look like there's anything over here, but I'm gonna try to go slow. Oh, there's a tree. Need these planks. There's one of the uh, quest items. Here's a special, <laughs> a special little thing here. A book with notes written in a foreign language. Okay, try to understand the notes. I mean, it might work, it might not. Oh, we don't have our freaking mage. Ugh. Yeah, ignore the book. Okay, we got some supplies right there. Easy peasy. What's this ring do? Hit points, cool. I'm gonna go ahead and throw this ring on to Brad here. And let's see, let's look at the map. I missed a piece over here, so I'm gonna go and try. Oh, nice. Y'all are finding traps pretty easy right now. Accept that. There's a chest over there, too, I'm gonna get. Hopefully. Got an 8. Perfect. What is this? Vial of Acid, huh? 8 to 12. That's not too bad of damage. Got my second quest item. Do I have anywhere else to go? I could go through here or go around. I don't know if I get progress points for... Didn't we already get those on? I don't know if we get progress points for going through these, but I'll see. That doesn't do nothing, so I guess going around just would use as a little extra supplies. We already got it completed. I want to continue to explore though, because there's resources everywhere and people to fight. Beautiful. Uh, it's camp. <laughs> Bad place to camp, but we'll do it. I'm gonna do four, get everybody nice and healed up, and we're also gonna have eight points to do. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to send you out for two to four supplies. We got three, we almost replaced what we used. Uh, stand guard, even though we don't have a chance of ambush, which is kinda weird, but I won't question it too much. And can I do first aid to someone or if it needs to be done? Doesn't look like it. 37, 34, 27, 57. Okay. Okay. Be hidden at the start. That would be handy. Would have picked that one next if I had more, but didn't have more. I'm going to go ahead and clear this corner down here. Seeing there's a tree. Beautiful. And now we're going to go over here and gather what we can get and then also fight these two. They're together. Look at them. Ugh. I'm gonna have to fight them back to back. There's no high ground on this. Oh, there is high ground over there, but it's gonna require a lot. I don't think I can hit anybody. No. That's fine. As long as they don't get adjacent to me, we're gonna be fine. Oh, you lucky. You lucky. Yeah, if I had a warrior, I could charge, but I don't. They're all spear wielders this time, which is cool with me. Sadist? What does that mean? Poison! Healer! Come here! Nice. So finish that, then we're gonna go ahead and take out somebody. 95% chance on you. If I do B, right? Oh, it just makes a hit chance. Go higher. So let's do this. We'll take this guy out, if I can. 13. We're gonna go ahead and move right here. Did he not get poison resist? Oh, I put freaking mind block on him, son of a gun. All right, a little bit of mess up on my part, but you know, it is what it is. Sneak attack. They're scrambling now. Let's go ahead and do this. Missed. Epic. Got to get some of them points back. Let's go ahead and move right here. Huh. Okay. 
Let's see who's got some high dodge, apparently. All right, that's, that's poison resist, right? Gotta make sure. Yeah, we're resisting the poison. 70% chance to poison somebody, man. That's kind of nuts, huh? I'm gonna go ahead and throw a block down. All right, hold that off. Should be able to take this out, no problem. Easy peasy. We ain't got no berry bushes, do we? No, okay. Just let you keep on trying to cleave. 70% 70, 70 success, and I'm gonna throw a heal on you. Cause you know, that's what priests do, right? 89%, 95% chance to stun, which stun worked. Uh, I'm just gonna hold off on it. No, no, we ain't moving. All right, so we're gonna move right here. Go rope the crap out of you. Sheesh, I might as well move right here. Attack with you as well. Get some damage off. We're all like super, <laughs> super down on mana, but that's okay. I gave both my archers the mana potions I brought, so maybe it's a good choice, maybe it's not. It's probably a good choice, to be honest with you. But, don't let me tell you how it is. Wasn't that 95%? How do you miss? Makes no sense. Alright, you move as far as you possibly can. 44, nope, I don't like those. I don't like those chances. Ninety-five percent, you gonna miss this time? No, nope. okay, good. Beautiful. Alright, so do I like move around you, maybe? Has a 5% chance to chain with you, huh? 12. Beautiful. And bleeding. Get it. Let's see. If I go... Actually, that's on the on the top, so that's fine. Go ahead and hit you. We're, we're taking them out slowly. We're bleeding them out. Don't you hit my priest. Dang it. You know what? Since you want to come here, we already got that side handled. Let's go ahead and uh, start smacking this guy with what we got. <laughs> Please tell me you bled up. Huh. Okay. Nice. Can you quit hurting my guy, man? I mean, he, he did nothing wrong to you. Your friend, he did something wrong to you, but nothing to you. What is the percent on this? Eh. Sure, you missed. Okay. It's what we don't want to see is misses like this. Wow, you actually hit him. Holy cow. They missed. Oof. Didn't miss with no poison, though. I'm gonna take care of this guy. That way, Brad should be able to finish it, hopefully. There we go. Give me that XP. I'm not gonna be able to venture for a second. Someone gotta level up, yeah. Little Miss Zoomy Zooms. That means I'm gonna be able to fly around the map now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one, everybody. Have a great day and goodbye.